Hello everyone. On behalf of Carbon Solutions and the University of Florida TRIO Center, I'd like to welcome you to Lesson 1 of Organizational Greenhouse Gas Accounting. In the first lesson, we will discuss the fundamentals of greenhouse gas accounting. Some of the key concepts that we're going to cover include why companies account for their greenhouse gas emissions, the standards and protocols used in the industry, the different sources of greenhouse gas emissions, global warming potentials, carbon dioxide equivalents, and the difference between carbon and carbon dioxide, setting inventory boundaries, and finally we will talk about setting greenhouse gas reduction targets. Before we move on, we're going to answer the most common question about greenhouse gas accounting, which is, what is it? Greenhouse gas accounting is a way to account for the emissions and removals of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. Just like financial accountants account for profits and losses, greenhouse gas accountants accounts for emissions and emission reductions. Typically, greenhouse gas accounting captures the six greenhouse gases identified by the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change also known as the UNFCCC. They are the same six gases covered by the Kyoto Protocol and now the US Environmental Protection Agency's Greenhouse Gas Reporting Rule. These gases are carbon dioxide, methane, nitrous oxide, hydrofluorocarbons, perfluorocarbons, and sulfur hexafluoride. 